Hello everyone, welcome to Happy Soul Journey. If you are my subscriber, welcome back. And if you're new, I hope you like this video, you enjoy this video and end up subscribing this channel and end up being a family uh, of Happy Soul Journey family, okay? So today we are having or we are going to discuss about that where this connection is headed, okay? Uh, it could be like connection with anyone uh, in which you are romantically interested, in which you are romantically, romantically interested, okay? So uh, we are going to look into their feelings, their thoughts, everything, where this is going, what their intention, uh, what is under the surface growing up for this connection or happening for this connection, okay? So we will look into all those things. Uh, we'll have some charms also. I'll use tarot. This will be very simple. I'll just use tarot. I just thought to do something different. Uh, I used to do uh, only tarot readings, no oracles, nothing else. So I thought let's do something like, you know, new. So I hope you like it. Uh, and if you are wondering about the person reading, all the information is in the description box below. And if you are wondering that, if you know that I offer a giveaway uh, of personal reading, free personal reading, one question personal reading, then you can uh, get the information about that in the description box below. Okay, uh, I, I'm going to give, give away to two people every month, free one question video reading. And uh, yeah, so that's that. And on that note, let's introduce the options. The first option is this beautiful world card. Second option is this beautiful daughter romance. So red, passionate. And the third option is the sun. So much of gold. Yes, and so much of life. So that is your options, guys. You can meditate over these options for a while. Uh, or you can pause the video. Or if you've already chosen the your pile, the timestamp for your pile is in the description box below. So see you there. Bye. Hello, option number one. So if you're choosing this world card, let's see. First of all, we'll look into that what is the feelings and thoughts of this person about you. So, okay, temperance. It could be a Sagittarius. Or this is a long distance relationship, or you have, uh, you know, you both could have met at like somewhere college where you both are doing higher studies, something, or you are in the phase of higher studies, or they are in the phase of higher study. That could be one thing, but uh, yeah, mm -hmm. and along with that, magician. So, oof, this person wants to have a lot with you, like having everything with you and this person is being patient while they are manifesting you they are like uh, trying to be like they are not going to give up on you they don't have any because they are really really attracted towards you because they want to have this ten of cups with you okay so their intentions their feelings their energy towards you is very positive very optimistic this person is going to fight for you this person wants to fight for you. This person is fighting for you. Uh, and they will take and stand for you. Okay. One more thing uh, I'm getting here is like a lot of fire. Uh, it could be that this person has a lot of fire in their chart. Or you have a lot of fire in the chart. Mm -hmm. Because uh, Sagittarius. Again this is a fire sign. This is a fire sign. And the magician is also giving me a very fiery look here. Okay, normally magician is like Virgo and Gemini card, but right now magician is giving me a feeling that, you know, a manifestation through fire. So if any one of you have done a manifestation through fire, 
uh, for this person or love or if someone you know if you feel that you are a fire magician you know so, and your strength is in fire uh, if someone feel or think like that um, uh, I normally don't say this but if you see yourself as a fire witch or that you manifest through fire or you're attracted to fire a lot, uh, then this is a special message because this person sees a lot of fire in you and they resonate with that because they also feel a very fiery energy towards you, okay? And this fire, fire energy is like uncontrollable, but this is not a destructive fire energy this is very very constructive fire energy this temperance is indicating the constructive fire energy because this is like tempering tempering uh, the intensity tempering everything but still it's a lot magician is like a lot of magic here and uh, but still the temperance is saying saying that it's not that it's 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 not wild it's control but control in a way that it's still very big okay so it's very very deep very very strong very very like motivated person towards you and they see future with you this person is, is like this is like seeing future this is like seeing future okay they are making the way um, with this again a fire energy so yeah you you both could be a, a gain of fire energy Ooh. They want to speak to you a lot. They want to go through everything. They want to do everything in their capability or maybe more than that for you because uh, like they feel a lot for you. It could be a possibility that this person right now, like I was getting a feeling that, you know, either this person is working for the higher studies or they are doing the higher studies or you are doing the higher studies. So there is an energy of student or it could be awakening that this person has some kind of you know realization recently that you know if that this person has done something wrong and out of their ways this person now see the beauty and they want to like amends their you know uh, whatever they have done because they want to be at par of you like you know I'm seeing a power couple here very very power couple here they see you as like you know they, that they can become a power couple with you and they this person fire is passionate it's sexual also it's passionate also it's love also it's like it's like they want to just explore with you okay explore the world it could be like explore the world and you you could be uh, in some way their world okay because yeah because they look at you like this my world my future okay so let's see what's where this connection is headed Ooh. so this card wants to come so there is no moving on here no moving on okay you're stuck with this person so let's see no matter how hard the situation is for few of you i feel or maybe many of you there's some kind of external issue which is like coming up between both of you but still this person is like no i want to be committed to this i want to do this no matter how hard it is i want to do this and that kind of feeling so this person really have very true feeling and this person is very confident that they want to make it okay so let's see Let's see where this connection is at. Ooh, Ace of Pentacles. So as I told you that if, if this person made some kind of uh, mistake and some done something wrong here, they literally want to make amends and have a potential very, very like stable new beginning. It's not an Ace of Wands. It's not just the, um, you know, starting of uh, like, you know, um, a spark it's 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 like a seed it's a seed and seed converts into tree no matter what okay it's it's not going to go and oh you got two aces they also want to tell you a lot of stuff so there will be a lot of truth can we do just reading of the under the deck cards do you really want me to pull like all the under deck the energy like this is like a true honest 
relationship true honest commitment offering someone true honest commitment truth okay truth and it is not just driven by the emotion it's also driven by the spirit it is also driven by the um, the mental you know the mental energy the intellectual energy okay it's also driven by like you got all the four elements can you see that can you see that and you got the magician so this person is going to collect all the possible elements all the possible thing that this connection need to create that magic magician is all the four elements and then the magician make the like bring the spirit in and make the magic so you got the pentacle you got the sword you got the wand you got the cups and this is the underlying energy which is which is giving me a strong feeling that it's like it's under the surface it's happening it's about to happen okay so it's like this connection is like meant to come together and this person is really working hard with that because i can see that in their energy okay let's see where this connection is headed what else okay so yeah i told you that this person is learning and you are also learning and you know the fantasy the the curiosity and the um the dreams that this person and you have like i'm getting a feeling that you know we are just child and child of god if you believe in god um so it is like we are we are all the child of god and the god this wheel of fortune the 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 goddess fortuna or the lord is fortuna is like supporting supporting this child to become the queen of queen of wands and king of wands okay so that was really like this is like very poetic reading which is coming up for you guys and very very happy for you it's like very 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 beautiful people are going to be consistent towards this connection and what else what else oh guys i cannot make it up like people are going to be consistent they are going to work hard no matter how hard the situation is they are going to come together in reunion or union or commitment and it's very mutual six of pentacles is also a card for me where you get the reward for whatever you have done in the past okay six number is related to that you know what you are getting in the future uh, in the future in the present of what you have done in the past okay so it's like it's a, for me six is six number cards are about uh the bridge the bridge between the past and the present and the past and the future you can say so it is like whatever you have gone through you both have gone through and you have grow through uh you have learned the lesson that's why you are getting the reward uh of uh, you know the the gift the gift of this love and this mutual connection okay it was hard it was definitely hard some time you both have uh, felt like you know this cannot be possible there this issue that issue um that person is not understanding or maybe their mother and father will not agree with it their financial situation is not uh, you know at par or uh, yes some kind of issue maybe they are stuck with someone else or they were stuck in some kind of uh, case or they are stuck in some kind of uh country so it could be a long distance relationship that was i was getting from their energy that could be, this could be a long distance relationship where you or them are stuck at some place or in some like you know there is some there was some stuck energy where you wanted something else but you were not getting it but you know you both have stuck through that thing and that's why you're getting this thing things were really hard you both have struggled a lot and uh, yeah things are coming together now okay so this connection is going to 
you know what I, one word I will give to the where this connection is headed. This connection is heading towards magic. It will be a magical love. Magical union. Magical connection. This connection will change your life entirely. This will give you the support, the love, the luck that you want. So this will be a very beautiful connection and you both have struggled through a lot. So this 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 is like you have earned it. Okay, you have earned it. What's the one advice you want to give to the pile number one? Time to go. So it's like it's time. I'm saying that this is like the underlying energy. So this is like it's about to happen. It's very, very fast. It's very close. So advice is time to go. If you were feeling stuck at somewhere, make a move. If you were thinking about that you should do something, make a move. So make a move. Do something. Okay, and that doing something is not eight of cups because eight of cups was reverse initially, and that's what that was because that came up. That's why I'm saying that there's no moving on from this connection. This person is like loyal to you. Ha! <laughs> this was so beautiful. Time to go. Loyal to you. Go the distance. This connection will go the distance. You know, this connection will go the distance. Absolutely, yes. Okay, so that was the reading. It was really, really beautiful, guys. I hope that makes sense and that helped you. Uh, this is like overwhelming. I don't want to uh, pull any charms here. Because I don't think that there's anything else that, that you know, there's left for this connection. For few of you, I'm getting a feeling... This could be your very close friend or this connection have started from friendship or this connection will start with a friendship but it will be like I'm getting a feeling like this will start with a friendship or there was already a friendship or this will restart with a friendship. So I'm getting that one thing for you people and don't you know don't pull yourself back of the attraction or the intimacy that you feel towards this person okay don't doubt yourself because at the center of the reading i'm seeing the wheel of fortune and this orange color i always see this card this is my personal personal thing i always see this card as sacral chakra that's why i'm talking about the intimacy here for you don't pull yourself away from the intimacy that you want to have with this person don't doubt that thing because this connection has the intensity to go very, very far away. Very, very far. Okay. So go the distance. You both are very wise because I'm getting an owl, owls here. So you both are wise. You both know what you are doing. And and cheetah is also, you, you know, a very fiery energy. So if this person is especially a fire sign, this is a very special message. Okay. Or if you have seen that kind of, it could it could be a possibility that this person is not fire, like sun sign is not fire, but rising sign or moon sign or Venus could be a fire. Okay, or Jupiter could, could be a fire because I'm seeing like somewhere something fiery is dominating this person. That's why this person is so much fiery in their nature. And it could be like some kind of compatibility that between both of your natal chart that is like very fiery because I'm seeing a lot of fiery energy. It is very attractive. Very attractive. Okay. So that was that guys for you. And don't worry. Whatever was that, that was the past. Just let it go. Just let it go. Okay. So I love you. Bye. Hello, pile number two. If you're choosing this door to romance, let's see. Let's see. First of all, look into that what your person is like feels for you, what's the energy towards you. Okay, one more. One more mixing up. So, for the door to romance, okay, the moon card, okay, the door to romance card, uh, card what's their person? feels towards them justice okay 
this is like very very weird but if someone's person or someone's like close to you or common is in jail then this is like this is coming to me okay if your person has went to jail or you are stuck somewhere or they are stuck somewhere i'm getting a feeling like there's something law and order very weird okay what's the energy Oh, it could be that they feel stuck with you and it's not a good feeling. They don't feel good about it. That you cannot get away like they, you are not going out of their head. It's not a good feeling. They feel very bound, very bound. And there's some kind of internal struggle. Okay in some parts it's like you know sometimes they enjoy the, their thoughts about you and sometimes they like this is not right I, I don't want to think about this person it could be that you were not so um, you know sweet with them it could be a very bitter sweet conversation like last conversation could be very bitter between both of you, you were you were in your truth-telling zone and you were saying a lot. It could be a possibility that you both were married in the past, okay? And uh, it was a very, very married or in a committed relationship or like, you know, and it was a very bad breakup. And this person is like, if you both are, um, you know, sometimes they miss you and sometimes they think like, I don't want to think about this person. Okay, so they are in a very complete struggle here that you know what exactly they want. And for some reason, they this person is the one who is keeping themselves stu stuck in this kind of mindset. Because they are denying something. Denying something to see, denying something to feel, they're denying something to face. And that's why they are in this kind of struggling zone here. Okay, okay, so for a few of you, if you both are like, uh, you know, um, like, you know, there's a, like, um, when two people like separate, if some, if some of you have a child with this person and you both are like having a court case over the custody of the child or you are arguing about the child or around the child, then this is a special message for you people that this, this is the reading for you and this person is really struggling of you know what exactly uh, they should think about you because sometimes they hate you and sometimes they like really miss you and they want you around uh, sometimes they think like you don't understand them and sometimes they think like um, there is a need of you know good kind of conversation so that you can understand them sometimes they feel they don't want to tell you anything and don't want to talk to you and sometimes they feel like you know uh let's have a conversation and get a clarity and then they just take a back like you know no no she or he will not understand this thing so there's a lot of internal struggle internal like very mental struggle here that this person is going through uh, what else we need to know about this person energy towards pile number two okay so yeah many for many of you i'm seeing that you were married to this person or in some kind of uh, strong connection or a public connection i would say okay so this person really oof this person really want to come back to you okay for a few of you this could be your childhood friend or there is like a child is connected here for a few of you um as if i like a you know child custody or yeah for a few of you i'm also getting that if you have a child or this person has a child and then this person is thinking that you know there's no future of this thing because like because they have a child or you have a child and because of the kids there's no future it could also be a possibility that you are married to someone and uh, and maybe you also have a child with that person and this person think that you know there's no way that you can get out of your marriage or you can move on from your husband or wife 
or you can maybe it could be a possibility that because of a child and uh, yeah there is concern around child either their child your child someone and like it could be possible that this person is in an internal struggle because they think that you will not move on from your um past okay no matter uh, like what you say because you are very very like for few of you you are like you uh, you follow societal norms for few of you i'm getting and this person think that you will not go against the society and do something like a divorce or separation kind of thing so you will not move away from your husband or wife but still they want to work towards you and that is the thing which is like they are struggling with that thing okay and they want to end this thing but they are unable to do that okay and they are really really disappointed with this connection they are trying to heal themselves they are trying to get a direction here they are uh, trying to get the clarity here but they are not getting any one of it okay let's have one last card and then we'll see that what's where this connection is headed anything else anything else about this person's energy towards pile number 2 anything else okay strength and heart of wand this person really want to uh, give you support and this person is very like try uh, trying to be strong to give you a structure that you deserve to give you a commitment that you deserve but for some reason this person is unable to do that okay um harfan strength is also giving a feeling of strong attraction because this is a strength card which is giving a sexual uh, uh sacral chakra energy to me and harfan is taurus energy which is about sensualness and yeah so this is again a giving a very attraction yeah attraction is there but uh, this person also want to be strong for you if you want their support in your like this thing like getting away from your wife your husband then yeah they are on on it one more thing is that if this is a three party situation where you are in some kind of relationship with them some kind of situation ship with them and you are still married to other person this person is very you know trying to control their urge to say that you know they want you exclusively okay uh, for few of you for time being this person is also for you like for few of you this is another story if uh, you if you allow they are ready to come in a three party situation with you if you are married or if they are married like this person don't want to let go of you it's like just tell them what kind of situation ship you want they they want to be there because not because they want that kind of thing but this person is like trying to be very hopeful with the star card trying to be very hopeful of that something you know something else will come up in the future things will change they want to they want to give you time to understand them they want to give you time to um, you know trust them or they they also need some time to trust you because this is also a combination of trust issue when someone is not um you know trusting their own judgment okay they are they are they are doubting themselves okay and there is internal struggle so this combination is also about doubting your own judgment so they they also need some time to you know judge this connection so it, if this is the thing like three party they are on it because they need some time they want to take it slow yeah they are in a fear of betrayal trust issues and they are also in the fear of judgment okay judgment so that was their energy now let's see where this connection is headed okay that was very new energy i'm coming coming up here yeah. so where this connection is headed three of cups definitely three party situation is in this thing but if it's not three party situation 
there is some kind of celebration that is going to come in this connection ace of pentacles some kind of new beginning if you both have separated or you know there was argument there was some kind of separation no contact or if you both are like don't want to re don't want to restart or start this relationship because of like uh, the all the reason I told you like situation shape marriage or all this thing not possible be child all those whatever the issue is whatever I you know discuss there um, there is like some kind of ace of pentacle is cooking up under the deck like under the energy underlying energy under the surface ace of pentacle is cooking like this person really wants you really really wants you wheel of fortune some kind of change of direction say change of luck change of decision it will come up very very like uncertain justice so in their energy there was a justice and they will get the justice so ooh. what else people are going to fight for what they want a lot of cards no cards are in cards people will fight for what they want okay Let's see what else. Where the connection is headed. Yeah, offer. They will definitely ask you. Ace of Pentacle and Ten of Pentacle. And King of Wands. So, oh, and a Queen of Wands. Okay. So, there is a very high potential, guys. This will be tough, but not impossible. But this person really want to fight for it. Okay. Yeah, I asked that what's your take? So your take is like you want this thing. You are attracted towards this person. You want stability but you want stability in your life i'm not saying stability with this person or the other person or whatever situation but at the end of the day you want stability you want things to be very so somber very very you know like peaceful but you are really attracted towards this person and this attraction is giving you a feeling of self-sabotage mm. let me see what's under the deck but you really want to talk to them or you want them to come towards you or you want this thing. It's like very confusing situation. Hmm. So let's see the advice for you so that we can get some clarity. What's the advice for the pile number two? So I'm seeing initial initiation and see exchanging gifts. So, to be fair, so be fair with this person, be mutual, okay? You also want mutuality here. Mutual give and take. So, if this person offers you something, I would say take it. It's not self sabotage anything any any other advice fork in the road yes you are at the fork in the road but uh, this is like this will make a big change in your life and it's very important when you are at a fork in the road that you listen to the other people you listen to other things you listen to society or you listen to your own self i'm not saying or not telling you to make a very wild uh, change in your life but you need to be very uh, thoughtful of what exactly makes you very happy in your life and what exactly you want okay breathe so when you are at the fork in the road breathe 
meditate, take a pause, okay? Do the day-to-day -day work. Don't think about it a lot. Visualize what you want. If you see there's a, like some greenish, brownish, then there is sky blue. This is like root chakra and throat chakra, root chakra, throat chakra. So this is giving you a feeling and then the regeneration will happen. So this process will be long guys, but there is a treasure. Okay. So this process will be long. This will take some time. There will be a moments when you will feel like, you know, being like this will not happen. This will not take place. I should not do this. This has all those issues. I don't want to do this. I don't want to put myself into that kind of cycle. I don't want to put myself in that kind of connection. It is very risky. What people will think? What will happen? Many questions. Many, many questions because the process is long. But I think this, this thing is like, it will bring you happiness. Plus, it will bring you some kind of growth in your life that you are meant to um, live or experience in this lifetime okay so that is the thing that i am getting for you okay uh, and you have the treasure inside you and, and you deserve happiness if you want to hear me out that you deserve happiness or not you deserve it okay you deserve it you earn it happiness is your love is your don't Pull yourself away from it. Okay? By doubting your own destiny. By doubting your own destiny. Because luck is on your side. Luck is on your side. Okay? So be patient. You don't have to make any move here. Let this person do the thing and then if you think like, you know, that this person literally making an effort towards you, then give this thing a chance. When you, you know, when you see this, when you feel it, when you experience it and you like it. Okay, then don't let the past give you a feeling like, you know, this thing will not work because it will work because change is in the wind. Okay, changes in the wind. So, if especially if you are a fixed sign of Taurus, Scorpio, uh, Aquarius, and Leo, and this is a special message. Okay, don't, don't, don't. Keep yourself away from your happiness. Okay, so that was your reading. I hope that makes sense and you enjoyed it. You loved it. That helped you a bit. And if you want to have a personal reading with me, information for the fee structure and the procedure is in the description box below. If you want to win a personal reading with me, I'm going to give a, a monthly giveaway of two readings. Uh, so I'm going to choose two people from my comment section. So you just need to comment below love and blessings. Um, and I'm going to look into the one month comments. And I'm going to make a lucky draw out of it. So if you win, then we can have a reading for you. Okay. If you want to donate for my channel, then uh, definitely any amount is appreciated. Thank you for all of the people who have donated in the past. That makes like I I bought these cards out of all that thing, and I've bought a lot of cards, so I'm very grateful for all of that. Uh, yeah. So this reading was a little bit like different on the note. I don't use more decks, and I felt the need to do just one or two decks. So yeah. I love you. Bye. Mm. See guys, uh, I've done your reading. It came out as very beautiful and very fun. I enjoyed it. But I don't know why, but my memory was full and it didn't record it, the whole reading. 
so if you want to hear this reading you are welcome and if you feel like you are like you want someone to pull the cards and all and you don't want to hear it then that's okay you can click off but if you are okay with uh, the cards that I've already pulled here and I'm going to explain everything here these are the cards that I pulled for the where this connection is headed but before this thing uh, I pulled the cards for how this person feels for you so let me start from there this person see you as some kind of temptation in your uh, in their life this person is not very committed kind of person and um, this person is like very free living not so committed they uh, for a few of you they just like they don't want commitment because of some kind of situation that they have faced in their life or some kind of like parents issue that they don't believe in commitment and marriages and this or that they don't believe that other people can care about you you can trust them this also person has a lot of trust issue this person is very smart very good with dealing with people but have a lot of trust issues and because they feel uh, a lot for you and really attracted towards you this person see you as a temptation because in a way like i was giving a lot of examples of prey and uh, the hunter so it's like a lion and the deer and rat and the person who is guarding the rat it's like you are a temptation of catching them and making them a prisoner of love where they will face a lot of pain because once they will give a lot of energy because they see love as very draining and very like you know things in a way um very draining so this person don't want to you know put their energy into this thing okay but when i asked about where this connection is headed let me collect these cards so initially you got two of cups so this person will not like like you know resist you they will definitely take a or make a move towards you and they will make sure that they have a starting with you okay because they have a ace of pentacle there is a like a new beginning emotional and committed new beginning that they feel and there will be like where this is headed this will happen because the king of wands will make a move okay then this card both came together which is talking about consistent moving towards 10 of cups so this person wants to move towards 10 of cups okay i think i got 10 of pentacle also for you let me see or i got that for the pile number 2 i don't remember no i don't get it for you okay so this consistent moving towards the ace of cups or oh, sorry 10 of cups uh because like there will be a consistent movement so there will be like service oriented if this person is a leo or a virgo or i'm getting a pisces here um or a earth sign then this is special message for you guys okay then what else i got yeah they want conversation between both of you they want uh, commitment they want to go out in the party in the public they want to celebrate with you they want to have much more time with you okay um they see this thing as like but you know just a second this is not just their fear it is like lesson learning okay and your connection and the attraction that they feel for you it is giving them the strength to for the first time you know uh, sometimes we have to risk a uh, thing or we have to take the risk in order to know that it is it was not that dreadful or the result 
uh, is not that much of fearful or you know the pessimism that we are feeling it's like we need to do that thing in order to you know get away from that fear so this love is will give them some kind of energy or some kind of courage to you know learn this lesson that it is not that much of like fear okay still the fear the these two cards came together so still the fear and the nightmares is still there and there's different kind of fantasies like there's jewelry there's treasure there is like dragon there is victory there is medusa the snake which can bite them and put the poison in their body and you know kill them in some way one more thing which came up in their energy was uh, tower and i told you at that moment of time that you know the energy is like if they make a move towards you it will be like the beauty will be caught by the sorry beast will be caught by the beauty so it's not about that you are a, if you are a male then it's not about that this is not the message for you but it is about that you know someone beast was like everyone were fearful of beast nobody could understand what is going on inside the beast or the truth of the beast but you know you will know and there's no longer that kind of aura that they have around the other people the dominance that they have around the other people the prey and the hunter like they see you as the hunter and they see themselves as the prey but normally what happens is that they are the hunter and the other people are the prey okay so that is little bit different and which is like bugging this person um what's next they but they want to uh, you know so they want to take a risk and end this phase and have a new beginning like ace of cups and so there will be ending of this phase someone will make an effort and someone will take a risk and yeah uh this person will still be in this kind of mindset no matter what they are doing so you need to be very observant towards this thing okay this person will also stalk you online you need to be very truthful here okay this energy is very much needed then there is like the couple the committed couple is coming up here and the lovers card came up so there will be offering of love okay and they will see that you know things were hard like they were seeing the situation as moon but it is actually the sun okay the advice for you which came up here is uh, no place like home go the distance and observer so which is giving me a feeling that like, you know this is like uh, i told you that uh, you need to be very observant you need to be very vocal you need to tell them that what's what's allowed what's not allowed what you want what you don't want what you desire what you do not desire what's your comfort zone what's not so you need to be very vocal about what exactly you want okay and what you are like not tolerate so you need to be vocal at that go the distance i would say take the risk and feel like a home be comfortable here okay but uh, be very mindful that this person is like not like what what example i can give you like a normal man like a normal good gentleman this person is a beast no not physically but this person is actually beast inside okay so yeah so they still uh, show you their colors and you need to be very vocal at that time you need to be a, a queen of swords at that time that you know you I'll not tolerate that I will not tolerate that and they will listen to that thing because you are important to them this is a temptation no matter how how much hard we try we cannot look away from the temptation and they see you as a temptation you're not a temptation you are a wish fulfillment something that you know as a child maybe they have wished that you know maybe i can see this kind of love or as a as an adult 
maybe I wish I can see this kind of love which is not there but I really want to see that maybe you are that wish but they see you as someone who will catch them and it will be painful because they will be prisoner and they will have to invest things and emotions and then you'll hurt them and all those stories that it's very typical but yeah it's very typical this person is like really in love with you and attracted and really need to move and do something okay so that was the message guys very confusive energy for you also for this person also but have faith have faith and enjoy or live in the moment okay so that was the reading guys let me know how it resonated and uh, it was a very long reading and I, but I explain it and uh, whatever I can remind or whatever comes up came up maybe that was how it meant to be but if you're new to my channel I normally pull cards on a camera so yeah if you want you can subscribe to my channel and you are very, very, very welcome in the Happy Soul Journey family. If you're wondering about the person reading all the information about the fees, procedure, everything in turnaround time, everything in the description box below. My email ID is also there, happysouljourney at the red gmail.com. Secondly, if you want to win a person reading with me, which I give on a monthly, which I used to give on a weekly basis, but now I'm going to give on a monthly basis because there is a lot more that I need to do. So... I decided that I, instead of like one reading every week, I decided to give two people um, give away, like two readings, two people, like one reading to one people. Like, ugh. So like two giveaways at the end of the July and at the end of every month, I will do this. So you need to just subscribe to my channel. You just, and you need to comment below love and blessings and I will count you in the lucky draw and let's hope for the best if you win okay so on that note oh if you want to donate for my channel any amount is appreciated the link for the donation is in description box below and those who have donated in the past thank you so much uh it is going in the channel i have uh bought a lot of cards and a lot of things like charms and all uh, because of those donations and thank you so 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 much for that i love you guys and i hope whatever i'm doing it making you feel peace at least the peace okay i love you bye